It's a day of reflection at the Great Park. The city of Irvine is hosting a site dedication for a new memorial paying tribute to the Armenian Genocide. This memorial will show honor to many in Irvine, to Orange County, and beyond. It happened just over 100 years ago, a mass killing carried out in the Ottoman Empire that is now modern-day Turkey. Genocide is not the murder of people, but the murder of a people. The goal of an Armenian Genocide Memorial is to remember and honor those one and a half million souls lost in the Armenian Genocide. It's to recognize and remember those survivors and those who aided them during these hor horrific times. Keynote speaker Judge Dikran Tavrizian was the first Armenian American to sit on a federal bench. He was appointed by former president and then governor Ronald Reagan. He was instrumental in the creation of a similar memorial 10 years ago in Pasadena. This will be the first in Orange County. By the end of World War I, 90% of the Armenians living in the Ottoman Empire had perished or were forced out. Women, children, and old men were rounded up and marched through the valleys, the mountains, and into the desert to perish. Design plans have yet to be drawn, but this inspiration board captures the key elements. Really being able to provide space for contemplation, for reflection, for education, and making sure that we tap into our universal humanity in remembering uh, and never forgetting. My great-grandfather was forced to flee his hometown of Urfa. They were among the fortunate ones to survive the horrors that they witnessed, unlike the one and a half million souls who did not. I especially appreciated when people shared about their own family members who had either survived the genocide or been victims of genocide. And uh, I agree with them that people should learn about it so that it doesn't happen again. These students from the AGM Armenian School, along with the community as a whole, will have a lasting tribute. Each Armenian family carries its own tales of loss and perseverance. And my personal hope that this site will bring some peace and will bring some hope to the memories of your ancestors, to you currently, and for your many descendants. Today is such a, um, and I'm gonna get emotional, but today is such a, an important day. Um, also, just to say thank you to all of the people and groups and organizations that believed in this and pushed for it. Today's site dedication pays tribute and raises awareness. It's also one of more similar memorials planned here for the park in the future. It is the first of what will be many memorials here at the Great Park that really signal a remembrance of events in history and the journeys taken by groups that ultimately wound up here in Orange County, California. We have so many different communities who live here in Irvine and we want to make sure that they all feel supported and safe and so a big part of that is recognizing where they come from and what they've been through. We are a small community but we're a strong community and um, these kinds of things really matter. <laughs> This is Valerie Starn reporting for ICTV.